Yo, boys! This is We the Play Deep into Bushwick of YouTube, and this is the last time I'm doing the intro and outro. From here on out, it's just going to be me stopping and starting it whenever I need to. Eventually, you should be able to have Pokemon you've caught go live in the village pastures. The most Pokemon the people can have with them while out exploring is six, apparently. Not that we have anyone who can manage that. Come now, you two. Let's not dilly-dally. Captain Silene awaits our report at headquarters. I can't wait to see the captain's reaction. It's probably gonna be pretty stoic, let's be honest. Well, uh, first thing I'm gonna do is save. Wrong button. I wish I hadn't used the potion so quickly, but not too much I can do about that. Alright, Silene. Let's see just how impressed you really, really, really are. It seems we won't have to leave you to die after all. Yep, that's what I figured. Congratulations. You passed your trial. You can hold on to that satchel. I must admit, you've impressed me. I set a high hurdle to judge whether a stranger like yourself could be worthy, but you cleared it. This is yours, the official uniform of the Survey Corps. You received a Survey Corps uniform and a pair of Survey Corps sandals. Get changed in the room you used last night. Then you are to report at once to the third floor. Present yourself in uniform to our commander. This is your first official order from the captain. Okay, okay. Oops, oops, oops. Oh gosh, there's an apple over there? <laughs> Alright, well. We'll, uh, check up on that apple later once I've actually done my job. Good thing this thing always shows me where I need to go. Hopefully that's not too annoying to some other people. Ah, the mirror, of course. Do you want to change your outfit? Absolutely. It is a priority. Time to put on your Survey Corps uniform and your Survey Corps sandals. Wow, look at all the stuff I have. There we go. Survey Corps candles. Sandals, sorry. Oh, wow. Hmm. Is it gonna be... <laughs> ooh, ooh, I kind of like that. Wow, so you all they get colored content. Text. Contacts. Please. Please don't. There we go. I love those eyes. I love that color. You changed into your Survey Corps uniform. So as I was saying, the real adventure begins. Look at you in the Survey Corps uniform. Now it finally feels like you're one of us. But I do wonder when the captain decided to go ahead and get a uniform ready for you. Hmm. I see you've changed. Regardless of your accommodations, you may continue to use the room you slept in last night. You may wear this as well. There we go. It looks pretty, I think. I mean, it looks natural. I'm just not sure if that's what I want to wear. Now present yourself to the commander. Oh, okay. Aren't you the commander? No? Okay. Report to the third floor of Galaxy Hall. Guess I can switch to the... No, that's the second floor. There's another staircase around here somewhere. 
boy, there is a lot to explore. Good gravy. Good timing, by the way. Hmm? I've been waiting for you. Well, at least my character is not always smiling. I am Commando, commander of the Galaxy Expedition Team. I say it with an S for some reason. So you are Brandon? Is that why you're so dumb? Because you are. <laughs> nope, we're not gonna finish that joke. You know your manners, at least. I've been briefed on your situation, including how you fell from the rift in the sky. Now then, let's see what you're made of! Face me in combat! Charge him! Go! <laughs> yeah. We all saw that one coming. You've got vigor. I'll give you that. You need to work on your sumo technique, but I do see some potential. Ow. How am I supposed to do this if I get injured on the job? And not by a Pokemon. Don't expect a warm welcome from everyone. Naturally, some were slow to trust an outsider, who literally fell right out of the blue. The superstitious among us might see your arrival as a potent of disaster. But you passed the trial that was put to you. No matter how odd you may seem, you're part of Jubilife Village now. Dedicate yourself to the work of the Galaxy Expedition Team and complete the Pokedex. But I warn you, Brandon. Pokemon are terrifying creatures. Keep your wits about you as you work. Hmm. Complete. Nice. So the commander has also accepted you. But understand this, you begin as a no-star of a crew among our ranks. Wow, I don't even have any stars. In other words, you have no rank at all. You are a janitor. Enjoy your new life. Perform well as a member of the Survey Corps, and you will move up through the ranks. Indeed, you see, the more you add to the Pokedex, the higher your rank will become. Oh, that's all I gotta do? That'll be easy. <laughs> If only you could see my straight face when I said that. That will be easy, I said. That will be easy. Working on your Pokedex will also, of course, bring you closer towards that goal of yours. To seek out every last Pokemon. Here, you will need this. You obtain the recipe for crafting Pokeballs. Very nice. Requires one apricorn and one tumblestone. Well, I didn't pick up any rocks during my first excursion, so... And 3,000 pokey as well. You will have to buy the necessary materials. What, I can't pick up rocks in the wild? Come on! Ray, you are an expert at crafting yourself. Teach our new recruit what she needs to know. Yes, ma'am, Captain. Get ready for a lesson in crafting. Crafting means making items from scratch. That's right. Whenever you need on your journey, or whatever you need in your journey work, you'll mostly make yourself. Some things you can buy at the general store, but it's good to try to be self-sufficient. That way, you can even catch Pokemon with Pokeballs you've crafted ourselves. Or we can. We all can. But listen to me prattle on. Let's go on to the classwork so you can try it yourself. Mission. The basics of crafting. So if I activate it, it's just gonna tell me where everything is, I think. Eh, it'll be good for the very beginning. So I think I could turn that off, honestly. I don't know if I could do it after I've turned it on, but I digress. Well done earning a place in our team. My name is Anth 
Ante? Ante. I'm the local courier. The professor asked that I ready you for a change of clothes, so here you go. I do hope they fit. But I'm already wearing my uniform. You received the everyday kimono and a pair of everyday trousers. Hey, I get a kimono. I hope you'll avail yourself of the village's humble shops. I have to wear that when I'm not on the job. Hey, hey! This way to the crafts works. Come in. This here's the crafts works, and that there is the workbench. That's where you craft things. Pretty self-explanatory, right? Okay. At least there's a hammer. When you step up to the workbench, I'll supply you materials to make some Pokeballs. Call it a present to celebrate passing your trial. And as for the money the captain gave you, feel free to spend that however you like. I'm gonna buy all the dresses. Any recipes you get should tell you what materials you need to complete them. At the workbench, just choose what you want to make and get crafting. Go on, try it out. You can use the workbench, the Juve Life Village, and the base camps to craft Pokeballs and other items. Crafting items requires a recipe and the necessary materials. Alright, let's do this. So, I guess I select the recipe I'm going for. And we'll take 20 of those, because why not? You made 20 Pokeballs. You put them in your satchel. Boy, that was way too quick and simplistic. Basics of crafting complete. Oh ho! Now that's some fine craftsmanship. Hard to believe this was your first time stepping up to the workbench, my girl, right? How did I do that so quickly? You'll recall, of course, that Pokemon possess the odd power to shrink themselves down. With the Pokeballs we craft, we can make use of that power to catch them. Also, that more Pokemon species can be duly recorded in the Pokedex. And on that note, here you are. Do I get more Pokeballs? Oh, no. Of course, I get a Pokedex. A volume for compi- I gotta write this stuff down? Ah. A volume for compiling the collected results of much Pokemon research. Professor Lavington continually adds to it with each report made on the Pokemon species. Yeah, I hope I'm not writing the description of every single Pokemon down. That's gonna be a problem. Well, let's take a look. There's my No Star member thing. That's good. Report to the professor about this new species you have managed to catch. Got it. I prepared this volume just for you. I hope it aids you well in your aim to seek out all the Pokemon there are in this grand region. Uh, it'll take plenty of research tasks to help the professor complete the Pokedex. I've got to get going on those myself. I'd be all too happy to explain more about the research tasks I could use your assistance with. Come join me at the Fieldlands camp whenever you are ready, my good Brandon. Hope I don't say my name by accident. Getting to work on research task. Which I forgot to press the plus for, but I digress. Hey, excuse me, I couldn't help but overhear. If you're going to the Fieldlands camp, would you mind taking care of a request for me? Oh, okay. Two for one. I'm standing guard, so I can't leave my post. But I'll be here at headquarters if you want to talk about it. People who have something to ask you will have a request icon displayed above them. If you fulfill their request, you may receive a nice reward. Why not? It is on the way. Hey, so there's this Pokemon called Wurmple. Have you heard of it? <laughs> I'm just gonna be that person that knows everything, even though that's not canonically correct for her. 
Well, you see, I was having a chat with Professor Lavington, and he told me that after a Pokemon gains a certain amount of experience through battling and the like, it will sometimes change its appearance and become stronger. He said it is a phenomenon called evolution. Evolution, evolving Pokemon. Some Pokemon can undergo evolution, which changes their appearance and stats. If one of your Pokemon has met the requirements to evolve, you'll be able to select the evolve option when viewing the Pokemon in your satchel. So that's a choice, not a requirement. Plus, it doesn't happen on its own. So I decide I want to raise a Wurmple myself and have it evolve. Are you gonna give me a Wurmple? You're part of the Survey Corps, aren't you? If you catch a Wurmple, could you let me have it? There'll be a reward in it for you, I promise. Just get me a Wurmple if you can. Well, I'm gonna have to catch two or more. Mostly because there's two different evolutions for Wurmple, so that's good. Okay, will do. There's another request here. Oh gosh, I can see I'm gonna get really stumped here. What's he saying? Ah, whatever. I know Shinx's ears had odd markings on the insides, but what were they? No use, I can't remember. This will keep me up all night. Hey, aren't you with the Survey Corps? If you catch a Shinx, could you show it to me? I gotta see one with my own eyes. Please, I can't remember for the life of me what those ears look like. It's driving me up the wall. What did Shinx's ears look like? Cool. I've got, uh, a Shinx. But I feel like I'm gonna scare you when I do this. Don't try this at home, kids. <laughs> Are you gonna follow me now? Yoo-hoo! Let's speak to the Shinx. Cute. Yeah, uh, Shinx to show me? Yes, it was standing right in front of you! Okay, well, this game's not perfect, obviously. Alrighty, let's have a peek at those round ears. Shinx! That's it! Its ears have that yellow cross pattern on them, kind of like a star. Can't tell you what a relief this is. Felt like I had a bone stuck in my throat. Only the throat's my brain and my bones a thought. Ill. Thanks for helping me get that bone out. <laughs> Again, ill. Ooh, got potions. Thank goodness I can... I have one more than the one I wasted during my first little task. Hang outside the village, are we? Stay safe out there, kid. Okay, okay. Alright, let's do this. There's our loading screen I knew we were going to have eventually. Rightio, let's get right to it, shall we? In order to complete this Pokedex of ours, there are a great many research tasks I need your help to carry out, my girl. The details of these tasks can be found in the Pokedex for you to reference any time. Research task or task you carry out to complete the Pokedex. Each Pokemon species has a different number of variety of research tasks. Press the down button to open your Pokedex and check the kinds of research tasks are available for the Pokemon you registered. Good gravy, how long is this? When you focus on a wild Pokemon in the field using the ZL button, you can also instantly check the research task for that species by pressing the down button to open your Pokedex right to that page. Some Pokemon will have some unusual research tasks, so be sure to check them out. Hmm, weird. I'll give it a look at least once. You must catch and battle diverse Pokemon species and carry out plenty of research tasks. Do so, and you'll gain research points and other rewards for your work. I thought this was just about catching every species. Now you're complicating it. Now there's one more nugget of wisdom I've got to share, Brandon. Wild Pokemon may attack you at any time. When they do, dodge like your life depends on it. Now I learn how to dodge. Uh. Look, just watch me, would you? Then you'll be able to copy what I do. 
This will. Here we go! Perfect. Dodge like a champ. See? That's how you dodge. A timely dodge will keep you from getting hurt by the fierce attacks of wild Pokemon. It'd be nice if I could train with this. And that key. That's the key if you'd rather not end up blacked out in some field like I did. Oh gosh, they're using blacked out instead of whited out now. When those Shinx got me with Thundershock, I might have been done for it. The security corps hadn't come and saved me. My gosh, you were about to die, man? But hey, no need to worry. Die to a Shinx, by the way. Let me just recount that. You've got me here to give you tips. I'll teach you plenty. Okay, now we need to know buttons. Game to work. Oh, wait, 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 it showed it. Dodge! 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 Perfect. Glad there isn't a stamina bar for all that nonsense I'm just now doing. And there goes the Bidoof! Bidoof just disappeared. No, no, no. Game logic. Don't even question it. Get ready for some Survey Corpse Wisdom. Focus on the Pokemon with the ZL button, then press the down button to open your Pokedex. You'll see what task you have for that Pokemon. This is a requirement, isn't it? And there's that Bidoof. Did you see that your research tasks for Bidoof include one about how many you've caught? That's right, catching just one won't do it. You've got to get two, then four, then more and more! Jeez, I hope you have a box ready for all of them. And when it's time to battle a Pokemon, remember the captain's switching wisdom. If you have items out, press X to ready your Pokemon. Give it a try now if you want. I'll go on ahead. Well, I don't need to fight the Beidoof. Not yet, anyways. Give me a sec. There we go. Let's see. Number of heavy specimens you've caught. Cool, I'm supposed to look for heavy bee doof. Number defeated. A number of different forms you've obtained. Well, it says I need two, so... Uh-huh. There we go. Let's get two. No, 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 no. Close, close to the bee doof. Closer to the beach. Okay. So I gotta wait for that cursor to show up. <laughs> he ran. Loved it. Perfect. Number of heavy specimens. Nice. Alright then. Hmm. I can't tell what the level is for the bee doof. So I'm kind of wasting time here. Look, I need to level up all my Pokemon, but I don't think always throwing them in the bow is always the best way to do it. Oh, there's a Starly over here. Alright, into the grass. Carefully. Here we go. It begins here and now. Oh, here we go. Number of times caught without being spied. Number defeated. I haven't even defeated one. Number of different forms you've obtained. Well then. Let's do all at once. Go Shanks! So at least keeping its guard up. It's level four. Shinx only knows quick attack. Quick attack again! Well, they use Gust. It's not very effective. Good. Pokeball, go! One. Boom. Love that fireworks. 
Good job, Shinx. And that levels up the team, too, because experience shares everywhere, guys! Get used to it! I may not have experience share with me, but that's just how this is going to go from now on. So, oh, 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 I don't know what that is. Hold up. I was going for those beer. Okay. <laughs> all right, all right, false alarm. I've got to stop doing that. Let's just throw... Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, don't mind me. Don't mind me at all. This is fun. I'm having a fun time. Whoa, wait, 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 wait. That's a thing I can pick up. Should have known. And who's this guy over here? He's not gonna bow me or anything, is he? The more energy a Pokemon's got, the harder it will be to catch. If you bow a Pokemon at lower its HP, or maybe inflict p paralysis with a move like Shinx's Thundershock, it should be easier to catch. Thank you. But don't forget the dodge! Yeah, I love them just doing this. <laughs> little at a time, guys. Little at a time. I know I'm laying it on thick, but don't forget to open your Pokedex when you focus on a Pokemon to check your research task on it. Yeah, yeah, I've been doing that. Just hold down ZL and press down. Try checking your task for Starly next. I just did, but fine, I'll do it again. One of your tasks is to catch Starly without being spotted, right? Oh, yeah. You can get that done if you hide in some tall grass to catch him. Give it a try. Yeah, all I did was battle. I'll go wait for you up ahead. Come catch up once you finish some tasks. Well, I can't do it all at once. We gotta keep going. Okay, well, that one technically spotted me. <laughs> it's going forward. No, 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 no. I don't think that counts, but you know what? I don't want to talk about it, honestly. There we go. Did it. Number you've caught without being spotted increased. Oh, there's a Shinx there. Technically, I haven't caught one without being spotted. Or just caught one without battling it. So, you know what? Let's give this the old college try. This is a bad idea of a... Okay. Sneaky, sneaky. There we go. Dang it. <laughs> Just gonna stand there. I don't know if the arrow goes up at all. Probably doesn't. Please stay this time. Yes! Yes, that was so good. <laughs> Look at me go. I am doing absolutely terrific right now. Oops. Hi. Hi. Bye. No. <laughs> I gotta remember the dodge button. That That's one thing that is absolutely important. Ooh, a Buizel! And whatever this is. Can, uh... Can one of my Pokemon attack it? It can. 
Ah, that was Tumblestone. Okay, then. Okay, you all saw that. I don't know what happened, but, uh, it happened. I am sorry it happened. Oh, stop! Stop the tree! Stop! The heck? Really? Go get! Weasel's looking around. Oh, shoot. I could have picked Hunter Shark. Oopsie. No, this is fine. Ooh, it's a female. Nice. Alright, Pokeball, go! Whoa! Oh. It escaped. Well... <sighs> okay. You know what? No. No, I'm not doing that. We'll just have to try again. I don't want to lose out on this weasel. I know I should have it in the red, but... Yes! Got it! Cut weasel. Good job, everyone. Ooh, times I've used quick attack. That's a thing. Around here, you can find a Pokemon called Weasel. Already did it, man! It's got an aggressive disposition. I gotta do it again, don't I? Gosh dang it. That means it will try to hit you with its moves. Just like Shinx, and you'll have to bow it to catch it. Do I, though? If you've taken too much damage within a short time, oh my gosh, look at that border right here. It's just glorious. You'll be in danger of blacking out. You can tell you're in danger when the edges of the screen turn red. Damage goes away over time, but you won't begin to recover if you're still being targeted by a wild Pokemon. Oopsie. If you take further damage after the edges of the screen have turned red, you'll become overwhelmed and black Speaking of which, your research task for Buizel will include seeing it use a certain move. You gotta see the move in battle for it to count towards that task. Wow, I gotta wait for my Pokemon to get attacked? Nice. So battling is extra key here. I'm going on ahead. Come catch up once you've checked off some of Buizel's tasks. Okay, I'm going to be bluntly, and I really mean bluntly honest. I don't want to do that task until I get grass type. That way, I can tank some of the attacks. You should have your Pokemon smash open sparkling rocks for you. You'll find tumblestones inside. The same tumblestones you need to craft Pokeballs. Because guess what, buddy? You're starting to run out of Pokeballs. Might be a... Might be a problem. Okay, there's a baby doof right there. Dodge! <laughs> I'm just gonna practice that a bit. Oh, I don't even have weasel. One, two, three, four, five. Oh. Okay, hold up. Can I exchange? Probably not. <sighs> so, okay. So even if I get a Buizel, oh, I could change the name from here. Nice. Even if I catch, I was saying Buizel, but even if I catch a grass type, I won't be able to exchange it. Oh no! You think maybe that might be a problem? Just maybe. Just saying. <laughs> job. We're gonna just worry about collecting materials right now. Oh, there's a weasel right there. I could try- st 
Stop doing that! You're ruining the immersion! It's funny, but it's also sad. People are going to comment about that on Twitter, and it's not going to be good comments. Alright, I'm going to see if maybe, just maybe, I can catch this thing without battling it. Nice. Okay, climb a rock. <laughs> he shouldn't be able to see me from here. Stop that! It's annoying! It's really annoying! Ah, oh, jeez. Oh, he's coming closer. There we go. Rats. Uh-oh. No, 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 no. <laughs> they started to play some music, too. Nice. The heck? It... No, that is a story. Like... Silly me. What is that noise? It sounds like something sleeping. Oh my gosh, stop. I'm pressing and releasing the button too quickly. Yay, Cyndaquil leveled up. Good, good stuff. Alright, so this is going semi-poorly. I'm getting some good things done. Woo! I got Stardust! Nice! I'm actually very happy about that. Keep a lookout. Oh my gosh, an Eevee? Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh, an Eevee. Okay, we are doing this. We are freaking doing this. Are you kidding me? Let's do this. Let's listen. Let's catch the Eevee that has its own cry again. It's level three. Wow, it's not even that strong. Interesting. Also, I cannot see anything. Oops! Oops! Okay, I don't know if I did that or a ponita. <laughs> this game's moving a little too fast. Cool. No, 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 no. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, I am going to try to get closer. But first, the heck. It's a Rapidash! No way, Jose! This is like the wild area. I'm not doing that. That is dangerous. It has red glowing eyes. It has red glowing eyes. This thing is freaking dangerous. No way. No way. Hopefully that's not the mother. Got intense. This got so intense all of a sudden. That's that's just great. I love it. Okay. It's a little too far, I'll be honest. Alright, you know what? I'm going for the run approach. This is running, guys. I threw another one by accident. Careful. Yes! Pony to caught. I'd battle one, but I don't think I have the Pokemon for that. A ball of mud? Are you kidding me? How stupid do you think you want me to be? going well, by the way. Like, really well. Oh, there's that Eevee again. 
Okay, instead of attacking this time, I'm just going to try to catch him. I'm going to grab leaks. Avoid the rendering happening right now. Whoa, okay. And I'm going to try to capture Evie. Where the heck did Evie go? Okay. <laughs> Alright. Boy, I'm going to be wasting so many Pokeballs. Oh, so close. Like, actually close. Hide behind the tree. They'll never find me behind the tree. <laughs> Almost hit the... Is it attacking? No? I think it's running. Okay. Sorry, guys. <laughs> I am attempting to figure things out. Oh my gosh. She just went further away from me. Oh, what were the odds? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. No, 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 no. Eevee, 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 Eevee. Fine. I'll do it myself. I also like how I'm actually sticking out of the grass. No, 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 no. Oh, I like that sound. Dang it! I mean, everything else about me sticking up, but come on. I've got 13 of these things left. Dang it. It, it went away, didn't it? Okay, so uh, my strategy of catching Eevee is not good. Let's be honest. Let's be blunt about this. So the next time I go in the bow for one, I should probably attack it once and then just throw Pokeballs, I guess. There are way too many Shinks over there. I don't like that at all. Now I need to be focusing on Bweasel. Otherwise, I'm not going to get any further in this game. But what I'd like is if I could get to base camp and see if I can exchange my Pokemon out. I don't know if I can do that, but that would be nice. Also, I need to find a Wurmple anyways. Cool. <laughs> Glad that happened. That was quick. Dang it. You know, I'd like to say I'm getting better at this, but uh... Oh my gosh. He's running, he's running, he's running. We got a runner! We got a runner! It left. Okay. Let's go for a battling instead. Can't see it, but it's there. Well, that might be too much. Wumple avoided it? Oh, shoot. Alright, let's just go for tackle. Alright, good, 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 good. We do snot poison. That is good. Ooh, that was a crit hat. Oh no, we do poison. This is the last thing we need right now. I don't want to lose my first Pokemon yet. Okay, Wurmple has been caught. Phew! Times you see it use Poison Sting. Nice. The heck is that? Oh, that's Wurmple again. 
know, I still got a few more Pokeballs to waste. Let's just try to catch one without going into battle. I don't need any more Pokemon getting poisoned. Thank you very much. So does that mean crit capture? Alright. Caught another Wurmple. Good stuff. Maybe be careful. Haven't had to dodge anything yet. Can't wait for that to change. Oh, <laughs> uh, let's let's check this for a moment. Can we zoom in? Okay. Getting to work. My gosh, camp is all the way over there. Ugh. And I'm still not even sure. Can I? Hold up. I would like it if I could put a... Oh! Oh! I can... Okay. I can quick travel. Nice. So, if I rest... <laughs> First off, is it gonna turn night? And second off, is it gonna heal my Pokemon? I heard the heal thing. Yes! Alright, well, that was kind of a quick, easy, stingy way to do things, but... I'm just kind of trying to figure out. Oh, here we go. Switch out Pokemon. If you hang out into the wilds, be well prepared. Don't even bother looking at me. I could use a rest. I already did that. I want to see my Pokemon. Here we go. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna take the female with me. Don't have any grass types yet, so I can't do what I was hoping to do. Well, they got Cyndaquil, so we don't have to worry about another fire type right now. All right. Okay, so I'm starting to figure this out. I'm starting to figure all of this out. And this is, well, Technically, I guess this is a good time um, to stop the recording, so thanks for watching, and I will catch you for the next one.